This video is brought to you by Spader VPN. Spider VPN connect with us, enable you to browse, game, and stream safely online. Make sure you click the link in the description below. Bonjour everyone, welcome back to the Mac by Channel TV. Now some bad news to bring on this Monday morning as we sip our smoothies and try and get over the hangover from last night's good news from yesterday's celebrations after that brilliant win against Aston Villa. Captain Trips yesterday, goal scoring Trips, is out for about two months. Now that absolutely stinks, doesn't it? Sorry to ruin your week, everyone. Happy Valentine's Day and all that shit. Yeah? God almighty, that stinks. That's just our look, isn't it? That's just our look. We're bringing in a player who transforms the club, the team, galvanises everyone around him. Leadership, communication, organisation, goal scoring, match winning, free kick taking, Kieran Trippier yeah? gets ruled out for two months. Breaks his metal tarsal. Breaks his metal tarsal. We'll get on the official statement in a minute from the club. That's why I've got the old specs on, the old balls on the day. Look like the teddy bear from Bo Selector. But we're going to get into that in a minute. But just my thoughts on it is I'm devastated, to be honest. Now, I don't want to be doom and gloom. But he's going to miss uh, some big games. West Ham away, Brentford away, Brighton at home, Chelsea away, Palace at home. Now, there's a good chance that Palace game could be postponed if they beat Stoke in the FA Cup. So they'll be in the next round of the FA Cup. But that game will be postponed at home to Palace. Um, and then it's Spurs seven weeks away after a two-week international break. So the main thing for me, a bit positively to chuck in, is that hopefully the injury to Manquio isn't bad and he can step in because I think having Manquio can definitely do a job there. He can slot in and do a job for, for Kieran and Trippier for us at right back for, for a, a month or two. That doesn't worry us. It just worries us. No disrespect to Crafty Craft. If Crafty Craft has to come in, he, he was all right yesterday, to be fair. But... Um, for a prolonged period, I'm not sure I've got much faith in Emil Kraft, to be honest with you. Five million pound, we all know about him. I don't want to hammer him or anything, but he's not quite good enough. So to go from Trippier to Kraft would be a big blow. Trippier to anyone would be a blow, to be honest, because Trippier has been outstanding. 13 million pounds, what a bargain, what a signing, what a leader. And he's connected with the club already, he's won with games already. You can see his influence on and off the pitch. So that's one of the worst injuries we could have had, isn't it, really? But um, as well as football... That's life, got to get on with it, got to move on, we move and try and continue this run of form, this momentum, this run of wins or unbeaten run would do me against West Ham and Brentford, just don't get beat, keep picking up points, um, but chances there to win games, no doubt about it, but like I say, let's hope Manquio isn't knackered as well and isn't out for a while because he could come in, maybe change it up, I've seen people say change it up, put Burn Shaw ourselves as a back three and then have the wing backs again, so have Target as a wing back on the left hand side. Um, and then, I don't know, you could have Murphy or, or someone else slot in that right wing back. Even Fraser could be dropped that deep. He's played there before. We'll wait and see. Speedy recovery to Kieran Trippier. Let's just quickly dive into what the club have announced. Loads of rumours flying around. He's going to be out for six weeks, eight weeks, broken this, broken that. He's going to have surgery this week, according to The Athletic, to speed up the process. Um, and it was a very short statement, to be fair, what the club have released on their website. Um... Yeah, Trippier went underwent an X-ray immediately after the game, and scans have shown a flash at the fifth metatarsal bone in his left foot. Everyone at the club, which is curing a speedy recovery, um, is going to be sidelined for the upcoming fixtures. So they haven't put a date on it, but this sort of injury normally leads to a, a good two months out, really, doesn't it? Um, we've seen metatarsal injuries in the past have led to those type of lines spells on the sidelines. So, yeah, not great news, but no mind it. We'll stay on the up. We'll stay on the up after the positive win yesterday we're going to be positive later pretty much i think in player ratings we're going to be back later for player ratings so keep an eye on that drop your thoughts below about trip you're getting injured is it a big deal well there's definitely is a big deal but how are you feeling on it are you are you okay with it he's already won with a couple of games will that be enough to put in good stead you think man Quio craft can do a job what would you do let us know about all of those things subscribe to the mike channel tv and enjoy yourself